I'm Tiffany Kenamore, the principal at Gosnell Elementary. I wanted to take time today and review some of our uh, ready to, to learn plan and how we're going to reopen school. This year, parents and students will have two learning options here at Gosnell Elementary. You will either be traditional, face-to-face, -face, which is a blended learning um, using technology, or uh, if you choose to stay home, you don't feel comfortable uh, coming to school, you can go to our virtual academy, which is online education. Will students be doing AMI packets if they choose to stay at home? No, our virtual academy is using Odysseyware, kindergarten through fifth grade, and Edgenuity six through 12. Say, so, however, you do have to be registered as a Gosnell Elementary student or registered in the Gosnell School District before you can go virtual. So if you were here last year, you are already registered. But if you are new to the district or in kindergarten, you must register first for school. Who will be required to wear face coverings uh, this year at school? That will be all adults, all staff in the building, and also any student in grades three through six that is following the CDC guidelines and the Arkansas Department of Health guidelines for those who need to wear face masks. Will visitors or non-essential personnel be allowed to come into school? For now, the answer is no, I'm sorry. No visitors uh, during school hours unless you have an appointment. There will be no food drop-offs um, at the office anymore. Students may bring their lunch, but they need to bring it with them when they arrive. Um, we will not take any food in the, in the office or brought to the cafeteria during lunch. That is right now no longer uh, available to students due to um, COVID-19, and I'm sorry. I've also been asked, uh, how will the, will the school day be normal for a student? We're gonna try to make it as normal as possible. We are still going to have uh, classes such as PE, art, music, library, guidance, all those classes will still meet. Students will still have recess every day. Um, we will be trying to uh, teach social distancing and follow those guidelines of being six feet apart where possible. If not, we will be wearing masks. Um, Will classrooms be arranged differently? Yes, our classrooms in grades three through six, we have taken out the tables and put back in individual desks. That way students can be socially distant inside a classroom. Social distancing will also be achieved in our cafeteria because we will have half the seating. We will have one group, or one grade level in the cafeteria, one grade level in the old cafeteria. Um, there are stickers been placed on the tables so students will know where to sit and how to space apart so we can achieve social distancing while in the cafeteria. I've been asking about open house. Will we have an open house? Yes, we're going to have an open house on Tuesday, August 18th at 5 o'clock. We are asking that one parent per student come. If you were here last year, we we're asking those students to stay at home. The only students who need to come are if you are new to the district or if you're in kindergarten. All kindergarten students are welcome to come to open house. Again, that will be on Tuesday, August 18th at 5 p.m. Some parents wonder if transportation will be provided for students. Yes, we will still be running buses for students to come to school. Our first day of school will be August 24th, and we will have the same arrival and same dismissal time. Students can arrive at 7.30 and they um, be let off here at the front. We have someone on duty. Um, either in the old cafeteria or in the cafeteria, um, and we will leave at 310. If you have a child with special needs um, in our district with a special education, 504 plans, dyslexia, needing OT or PT, all those services, yes, will still be delivered if you are here or if you are doing virtual. You just need to contact Elizabeth Rice or the Special Services Office. All those services you will still get no matter which option you choose. If you need to register for kindergarten or register for school, um, please come to the elementary office from 8.30 to 2.30 any day this week, next week. <laughs> come as soon as you can because we'd like to know who all is going to be returning to school um, this year. If your child was here last year, there is no need. We roll over everybody, but if you are new to the district, we need you to come register. If you're in kindergarten, we need you to come register. So please come register for school at the elementary office.